Okay. All Who? I can say is I'm so excited to be judged by a panel of my peers. <laughs> 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 you fucking wish I did, you broke ass bitch. Okay, who, who's going first? Who's going first? You can go first, all right, by all cool. means. Okay, Fatty's going first, seven jokes each. Give us some energy. Let's roast. Which is surprising because she looks like if she took a DNA test, the results would just be Marilyn Manson there. <laughs> uh, Adam is an orphan. Both of his parents have passed away. Uh, I'm not being a dick for telling you that. He'll tell you that himself in the first five minutes of meeting you. I think it's kind of lucky for him that that happened, though, because if he didn't have that to tell you, he'd have to have an actual personality. <laughs> Yeah, they're hard to get when your parents are dead. Uh, <laughs> 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 instead of hoodies, Gina steals her boyfriend's trench coats. <laughs> <laughs> um, Adam is sober. Give it up for him. Amazing. Yeah, Adam doesn't drink or smoke, but not because he ever had a problem. Uh, he did that for his health, which is funny because that's clearly the only thing he ever stopped doing for his health. <laughs> yeah, let's be more of it. Like, when, if your sight doesn't work, your hearing's better. Uh, <laughs> Gina got her belly button pierced in a friend's basement, and it's the nicest place she's ever been penetrated. <laughs> I had a joke that I wanted to write about Adam that kind of relied on him having a celebrity look-alike, and I couldn't find one. Uh, there's not as many Jewish lesbians in Hollywood as you would think there is. No, you're just not watching the right shows. <laughs> because it is only ever eaten by sad, lonely men, Gina calls her pussy the goth pocket. <laughs> See, uh, I, I also tried to think of a nickname for Adam's penis, but I realized the be best nickname for his penis is just Adam Quasla's penis because uh, it scares women away and makes them leave a room. We don't need a worse comparison. I call it sport. Gina <laughs> <laughs> listens to true crime podcasts and angrily turns them off when she finds out the killer had a girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Adam wears transition eye lenses, which is a style choice reserved for toddlers and grown men who think they actually give you night vision. I'm just too lazy to wear sunglasses. Uh, Gina dresses like she transforms into a wolf. Eh, Gina dresses like she transforms into a wolf every time there's a full work tour. <laughs> Adam looks like he's on a first-name basis with the staff at the very last VHS porn shop ever. <laughs> Dana had a very tough winter. La all right, last joke. All right. Uh, Gina wears all black a lot, and uh, people make... She's not doing it tonight, but she does. And people make fun of her by calling her Wednesday Adams, and I don't really think that fits. Because Gina crushes it with the makeup, and Wednesday Adams still talks to her father. <laughs> Adam is what happens when you come into a bottle of Mountain Dew, throw it a bar mitzvah, and raise it to adulthood. <laughs> Give it up for them, everyone. That was, that was something. That felt like a hate crime on one side. And it felt like someone was attacking my younger sister on the other side, which was weird. Who, Adam? Yes. 